<laughs> okay, you ready? Yes. Hi, my name is Jo and welcome to Back to Basics Health Solutions. Today I have Carla. Carla. Carla is joining me for a quick chat session in relation to how her program's gone. Um, she has been one of my group clients that has been in the, the group platform. So we've got the Back to Basics Staying on Track group page, which is where you're probably watching this now. And we also have a private membership site that we can interact with each other. So thank you for joining me. It's okay. Okay. So before you contacted Back to Basics, can you tell me a little bit about how you were feeling? I was feeling fat, depressed, angry. I would spend nights on the computer Googling diet tips and whatnot, but would never follow through. I finally Googled Weight Loss Townsville and Back to Basics came up as a recommended site and yep. made contact and you rung me and... We have a, yeah, there is this history. <laughs> so even though I'm locally here in Townsville, we have the online platform, which I've spoken about. So the online platform makes it even easier. So it doesn't matter where you live in Australia, you can still be in contact with the, the Healthy Living Program. So how did you find the platform easier? You didn't have to come back and forth from no. work because we could zero in in the, in the group sessions? I found it so much easier because I could make contact in my own time around my schedule, around work, around the kids around netball training, around yeah. soccer training. Because yeah. um, we're really time poor these days because yes. I, you know, I know that we're all busy and um, having that platform where you can just either comment or tag or ask a question yep. in your own time and then I'll generally come back and answer you with what yeah, you need to know. very quick with your responses. So I try to be. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, my husband says I spend way too much time on, the, on oh, my phone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so before you started the Healthy Living Program, how did you feel? Um, again, I felt depressed and angry yeah. and guilty because I put on weight again and was just not in a good place. Yeah. Okay. So from wor wor working back towards before Christmas time, because that's when you started the group session and we're now into the new year, how do you feel? Well, how much weight have you lost so far? Lost 11 and a half kilos. Very so nice. exciting. Okay. okay. And how are you feeling now noticing the difference in the way you feel from when before you came and started to where you are now? I have loads more energy. Before I would wake up in the morning and I'd think about when I was going back to bed that night. Just no yeah. energy whatsoever. So it's a bit like Groundhog Day. Yes. You wake up, you go to bed, you do the whole routine thing and then you sort of want yeah. to try and get back and into bed again. That's that, And I just wasn't happy. Yeah. It's just, it wasn't a happy wife, happy life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So what are the things that you found really easy to do with the program? So whether it be through your meals or fitting it into your lifestyle, tell me a little bit about um, that. The meals were very easy because they were everyday food yeah. and that was probably the easiest thing. Um, I have problems with money so I actually wasn't exercising but the food was working for me. So. Yeah. And it, even though Carla hasn't specifically been exercised, so she's lost 11 kilos, she hasn't exercised, that's fine because at the end of the day it comes down to 80% food, 20%, uh, yeah, 80% food, 20% exercise. As long as we have some form of movement, the food has to work. Yeah. So, you know, you could bust yourself at going to boot camps and things like that, but if we don't have the food in right, mm. you're just doing all that energy output for nothing. So for you, it's, it's completely worked and you're having an operation on your knee anyway. Yes. So this is going to be great because even in your downtime, when you're going to have, you're going to have a couple of weeks off, yeah, aren't you? I am going to have a number of weeks off. Yeah. So this means that by able to still follow through the program, you're not going to be one of these people that are just staying at home and putting on weight because you yeah. can't be active. You know that this system works and you haven't done the exercise so far. Yeah. but you still feel good and fantastic. I feel great. Okay. So what are the meals that you like so far that you've been creating? Because this is about, you've got four kids at home, yes. so this has to be family friendly and that's one of the things I like to do. It's not a diet, it's a, it's a way of life. Yeah. So tell me about the, some of the meals that you've even made at home or even the kids you've told me that the kids have been cooking. Well, beef stroganoff or chicken stroganoff, either one is family favourite and butter chicken. Yep. Kids love it. The kids have been cooking that, they've been learning from it. They're probably the two top five. We have them most weeks. Yes. So. Yeah. Um, and are you surprised, once we spoke about reading your nutritional labels, are you surprised about the amount of sugars that are actually found in, yeah. whether it be processed food, so they normally come in a packaged food, but are yeah. you surprised that there's so much sugars that you didn't realise was sugar? Because yeah. most people will think um, sugars are just chocolates and lollies. Well, that's not absolutely correct. Um, but how did you find that? It's quite shocking. Like you look at the food panels now you look at the ingredients and like i used to be a big fan of continental recipe mixes and you know the packet sauces and when you actually take a look at them and you see the sugar content and everything else you go no wonder i wasn't losing yeah. weight so now cooking back to basics and just using the herbs that have been sitting in my cupboard for ages actually being used 
Yeah. Same flavour, same meal, just as easy. Actually, they even taste better. better. Yeah, <laughs> much better. <laughs> they do. So, um, what are the three key changes that you have found or noticed in relation to either how you're feeling or how the programs work for you? Number one would be energy. Loads more energy. I'm buzzing around. Second, within the first week, my bloating and my stomach went down. And yep. just that alone just made me feel so much better. And again, happy. I'm just yeah, so much happier. Happy. So you think your self-confidence has increased? Very much so. Like I'm back to wearing normal clothes where I used to kind of wear baggy things Cover yourself up. Yeah, and yeah. that happens a lot. We sort of, and, and sometimes we have to get to the memory back to when we are buying clothes that we're not always buying those bigger clothes again because yes. you know we're, we're smaller now, and you can fit into yeah, those you, clothes you, you want to wear. Buy the clothes and you go try them on. Like, oh, that's right, I got to go down a size, yeah. and that's the best feeling. Yeah. It's absolutely awesome. Um, so, do you find that you're uh, hungry? No, it's. Pretty much never hungry. You've got to break the habit of snacking for the sake yeah. of snacking because I'm bored or, you know, it's just 4.30, the kids are occupied and I'm sitting there, oh, let's have a snack. So, and then when I think about it, it's like, no, I'm actually not hungry. I'm just yeah. finding yeah. something to do. Yeah. So even just understanding that difference and that's part of the educational tool is, you know, being bored to do I really need to eat food or actually, you know what, I'm not hungry, I'm satisfied yeah. because a lot of us overeat and boredom does play a part and then also, too, certain foods trigger you up off to eat more and more foods when you don't really need that extra fuel and energy because you're not burning yeah. it out. Okay. So did you find, even with the online platform, the accountability sessions, how did you find that they work for you? I liked being held accountable. So checking in each Monday, seeing my photo there was a reality for me. And then being able to see each photo I've taken each time was motivation to keep going. So. Yeah. I liked it. Yeah. And the group, how did you find the group, when in the group platform, do you find the support's actually quite great there too? Um, it has gotten better. I like it when other people are involved. I love seeing other people's successes because that kind yeah. of also gives you a boost to go, okay, they're doing great. They've had a rough day, but they've gone and done they've aqua got... aerobics like someone yeah, did yeah, yesterday. I'm she like, did. I can do that. I can get in my own pool. Yeah. So it's nice to have motivation from other people's other success. Other people, yep. And we have another section in the group one called food porn. Uh, this is about the only <laughs> place that's acceptable that you can upload your photos and no one is going to rouse on you. Because what happens is that we, we eat with our eyes. So normally if we see something that's really yummy, it encourages you to either create it or cook it, um, put it on your menu plan. Mm -hmm. But there's many meals. Carla is actually really good at this. <laughs> and she's uploaded quite, I mean, I upload a fair few photos too, but Carla yeah. has uploaded some just recently. One was a chocolate chocolate mousse and one was a cheesecake which she's not normally no. a sweet dessert person but it just so happened that these ones Special she's attention. done and, um, and I'm still trying to find her address because I know she lives here in Townsville so that, that I can pop over and have these desserts but you know you've shown other meals you know you've shown a photo with the kids cooking yes. um, but it encourages everyone to make these meals and they're, they're not hard they're simple no, recipes simple. and that's one of the reasons we like to say back to basics is because it's basic food, normal everyday food, putting them into a family lifestyle. Yeah. So do you feel that, I think you, how much weight did you want to say you want to lose now, another? I, I wanted to get at least another five kilos. Yep, okay, so you've taken down 11, we want to do another five. So can you see then as a lifestyle plan, incorporating the foods that we've got mm. now, how easy it is to keep your weight off by just using these foods? Very easy, like, I think we are convinced and hooked on it. It's it's really not that hard to do because you're eating everyday food and it's budget friendly food as well. Yeah. Like I'm all about, I have four kids, so I am budget friendly. I'm all about quick meals. Yeah. And this is just fitted right into our family lifestyle. That's fantastic. So, so my job's done, yep. your job's done because you're losing the weight, you're enjoying it, you're feeling fantastic. Yes. And that's all I could want. So my result, my success is actually seeing you guys have a smile on your face because that just, that just excites me the most. And, and I really get a kick out of it. And that's all I could ask for. I know my Thank job's you. done. Thank <laughs> well, thank you, Carla, for joining me. I, I know it gets a little bit nerve-wracking doing little interviews, yes. but thank you very much. And uh, I look forward to catching up with you guys later.